Hello, my name is Ashley Sharon. I'm the founder and CEO of Share Love Fund. Today I have a little furry friend with me, and we are um, learning the cues of the new poses um, in our RYT 300 yoga teacher training. I just want to make sure I get this name right. I'm going to take a little peek. I'll be right here. Um, okay, so this is upright seated angle pose. Okay, so for upright seated angle pose, I'm going to um, uh, show you uh, my version of it. I fall out of it a little bit, and then I'm going to use a handy dandy block to show you a prop um, if you sort of have the roly poly syndrome that I do. You don't need a block or anything um, fancy. You can um, put a sweatshirt behind you or even use a wall or so forth. So, um, I forget the name of this pose yet. Sorry, I'm just going to check and then I won't say it again because I don't think it's going to stick with me. Um, okay, upright, upright seated angle pose. Okay, upright seated angle pose. So, some of these things are a little wonky because as you know in our RYT 300, um, we take a deep dive into the 84 classic Hatha yoga poses so that you really understand what the ancients were doing and um, see how yoga has evolved. So with this pose, um, let us begin the cue from Easy Seat. And please forgive my furry friend, but he wants to be an RYT 300 too. So from Easy Seat or Sukhasana, inhale and bring your knees into chest. From um, your knees into chest, I'm just going to um, go to the side so you get, um, actually we don't need to do that for this one. So from the knees into chest, grab a hold of your feet. From grabbing a hold of your feet, inhale, slowly bring your legs up. Once they are up, widen them. You're not supposed to fall down <laughs> behind you. I'm gonna try it one more time unsupported and then I'll try it with the block. Okay, so bring the knees into chest, grab a hold of the feet, straighten them, like unsupported back stretch, and then widen them. So that's not so bad. Then when you're ready, bring it back in, your knees into chest, and slowly bring your feet down to the mat, and then you can sit crisscross applesauce. Now I'm going to show you um, a modification with a block to support in case um, you know you're rolling into plow from it, if your tailbone is a little roly poly. So you can put a block behind your sits bones. Again, you'll inhale, bringing your knees into chest, and grabbing hold of your feet. Um, pressing your feet up and then to the side. So I'll try that facing forward with the block, bringing the knees into chest like this. As you feel ready, you can bring your knees back in, come down, uh, planting your feet on the mat, and come to easy seat. Thank you so much for joining us today. Namaste.